So, more car shit. So I'm at the shop waiting for them to plug my car in so I can figure out why the check engine light is on. Cause I think I know why, but I need to confirm so I can start figuring out how to solve the problem, right? But I just learned something. So if y'all look right here, I also need a battery, right? And I just learned that CCA is how many cold cranks your car has. So in my pursuit for a battery, I need a battery with 640 cold cranks or more. So all of the electronics and all of the stuff in my car can work. Um, so uh, we're gonna figure it out. We come from poverty, man, we ain't have a thing. We come from poverty, man, we ain't have a thing. Checking the drink, man. All right, so he told me a couple different things. He gave me my um my my CC some 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 my battery uh joint, but what he also did was give me the code reading, and it's saying camshaft or crankshaft. I ain't gonna hold you. I don't know what neither one of those things mean, um especially for a newer car. But now we got a little bit more information about what exactly is going on with the car and uh from there we're gonna start working on a solution all right y'all now we gotta holler at another place i'll holler at y'all when we get there so i got to the place we're gonna pull it up to the uh look like a like a, a wrecking yard type situation wrecking yard warehouse we're gonna pull it up so we can see if we can try to get a discounted battery because i don't want to pay the full price a2020 battery yeah, so same battery, but 2020, kind of old. Okay. 650 like, cold cranking. Like yeah, I think so. Right, I want that one. Do you, you, you guys recycle these? Um, it has no value to us. Okay. No value. So if you can get money for it somewhere else, okay, dude, take, take it somewhere it. else. Yeah, okay, all right. Yeah, because we, we, we scrap them, but they have, we don't buy from people. Okay, that makes sense. So I'll help you out. You're paying cash or card? Uh, card. All right. Listen, so I got here to the, to the, uh, to the warehouse he helped me find the battery right find one that works um and right we we matched it up and cranks and all of the you know what i'm saying he was knowledgeable of all the good stuff and i'm talking about quit he gonna ask me do i want 50 percent off of the battery for leaving them a positive review on google Man, I'm talking about, listen, I couldn't type fast enough, man. My feet, I was trying to get I was trying to get the autocorrects out the way, man. I was trying to type that damn review so fast. Listen, I just was on Facebook Marketplace, and this is how I found these guys. I just was on Facebook Marketplace looking at different batteries, and there's a guy that got a brand new battery that posted it. It was like 60 bucks, and I was talking to him earlier, but... You know, when you uh, when you talk to people that's selling stuff, oftentimes they'll respond in the right time frame. You know what I'm saying? So he didn't respond in, in the time that I'm like, bro, I need the battery today, today. You know what I'm saying? Not yesterday, not tomorrow. He ain't say nothing. He's like, yes. You know what I'm saying? I, look, I typed the long ass thing. They said, yes. Yes, <laughs> yes what? Yes to what part of what I said? Which, which, which portion of what I said are you saying yes to because i didn't ask do you still got it nigga i'm assuming you got it and i'm telling you i want it but these are the stipulations but uh you know what i'm saying that's a, just a little little god dust that he's sprinkling on me today and uh we'll see y'all when we sprinkle some more dust five hours later Woo! so we now gotta um, Blasto dry engine cleaner. I don't know what the. All right, soap, foam, foam brush. Yeah, that. Now we gotta wash the other car. The other car been sitting for seven years, nine days, and two months. So now we at the wash house, and we gotta. Watch this thing. Hold on. Three minutes. I'm gonna get enough, man. Oh, well, I tell you. There ain't no broke motherfuckers working as hard as uh, Kevin Hart 
and uh, and uh, and uh, all of them, except us. I ain't going to hold y'all. This shit ain't no game. Ah. So, I'll see y'all in two seconds, but for me, it'll probably be a couple days. I'll holler. Man, the disrespect be real, gang. I'm telling you the disrespect be real. They keep sending me eight, nine, and ten dollar orders, but pin this. I'm in Seattle. I'm in a certain city if you're not from here. They trying to send me to Renton, to 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 um Tukwila, to Issaquah for eight dollars. Bro, that's crazy. Y'all see where I'm at. You see where I'm at. My son, like, bro, if you stop accepting them, then they, it'll retrain the system, right? And I'm, 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 I'm hundred percent with my man on that. But they already got my thing. Like, hold on, let me see if I can see it. Cause it was like, you accept less. Your your acceptance rate is lower than what it should be. I'm like, what that mean? What y'all talking about? No, it, it ain't. It said it before. It ain't saying it now. But they're like, your acceptance rate is lower than the other people in your area. Yeah, that's smooth, but bro, first of all, I gotta drive there. I gotta drive to there. I'm not in that city. Y'all not compensating me to drive to Renton. We ain't talking about picking the order up and then driving to the customer, because that's what you're talking about. I'm not over there. Find somebody as hungry where I'm at. That's all I'm asking. Find a hungry mother sucker out here where I'm at, in the direction I'm going, in my neighborhood, where I'm at, and I'll take them some food. Not where you want me to be. Y'all could, listen. All right, man, I'll see y'all later. One eternity later. It's been a while. It's been a while. Since the last time I seen y'all, we had that car stuff going on, right? Man. We got the other car running, right? And from there, we've been trying to figure it out. We've been trying to figure it out. Yeah, we've been trying to figure it out. But what I want to tell y'all about, real quick. We, I've been showing you guys a large part of what we do for the money, right, is the Uber Eats. And what does that mean? I mean, you go to restaurants, you pick up food, you deliver it to strangers. Make sense? But... I also have another income source, not as significant, it trickle in, but it, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes the dollars make money and they make sense. The Fast Food Savings Club. I think that's what it's called. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put every, all the information on the screen for y'all. I've made almost $70 with the Fast Food Savings Club, y'all. I'm talking about, look, look at this. You know what I'm saying? Email, email. Email, email, boom, congratulations, you've earned some savings. So you go to Chipotle, Subway, uh, uh, Papa Murphy's, uh, Domino, Popeye's, and all the other stuff you see on the list, and I get 10% back from what I spend. So then I have the account, and I just go to the account, and I'm able to cash out directly to my bank account. Boom, boom, pow, pow, pow. So it's kind of like having those credit card savings without having a credit card. You know what I'm saying? You put it, you detach it to your debit card, whatever, whatever, whatever. You know, I'm talking about something I pay with the Apple Pay, but I use my debit card with the Apple Pay. Pop, pop, pop. And then congratulations, you earned a saving. Now you getting paid to be a big bag. I'm, listen, man, listen. You eat too much of that stuff, you're going to have a heart attack. But... Everybody, you know what I'm saying, venture out into the world of I need food quickly. And if that's you, there's another way for you to save while you're getting busy with to get busy. So if that sounds like, you know what I'm saying, you're trying to make the dollar holler and you're trying to make the money make sense, I'm going to give y'all the little um, sign up thing down there in the description. You know what I'm saying? You you do it. You you don't. You, you want to do it. You do it. You don't want to do it. You don't do it. Ain't got nothing to do with me. But if y'all want to save money on 
your fast food purchases, man, holla at your guala and I'll see you tomorrow. And uh, I think that's it. That's all we got for this video, man. Uh, we'll holla. You know what I'm saying? Uh, anything else I want to say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go watch that video up there from last week. And then when you get done with that, watch the other video. And then when you get done with that, we damn near family. So you might as well subscribe. And we'll see you guys on the next video. We come from poverty, man. We ain't have a thing. We come from poverty, man. We ain't have a thing.